Saturday, March 40, uh, March 15, 2014. This hamster is very weak and has been drooling, has been drooling, and urinary incontinent now. She lost a lot of weight, she's 31 grams. Now, ask, the owner asks, what is all this lump? These are subcutaneous tumors, one, two, three. And uh, they believe that the hamster is drooling because of the, of the teeth being over, overgrown, but it, it doesn't look like it. It looks like there is a big abscess. Now, this hamster is very old. I will give some guess, some guess, a few seconds. But it's very old to check the mouth. Now this is a 5% isofluorine plus oxygen. 5% you can see isofluorine plus oxygen. And uh, just for a few seconds, but it's very, very, very weak. And uh, uh, check, uh, check the check the mouth. Okay. This this hamster has urinary incontinence. And uh, okay, we check the mouth. Definitely, it is quite long. The teeth is long, so I just cut it, trim it a bit there. Yeah. But. Uh, is waking up again. Yeah, it's overgrown. Okay, I'll cut it off first. Now I'll give a bit more gas and check whether there's an abscess or not in the mouth. A bit 5%. Uh, very seldom the hamster leaves so old. He has been given a vegetarian diet of, of fresh fruits, fresh maize. And that may be the reason. Okay, now I check whether there is any abscess. I see there is one abscess here. Abscess at the chip there. Now this abscess is very stressed out. There is another abscess. Then you can see, uh, I put under anesthetic again, and I think the videographer should come this side, come this side so that uh, you can see the, what I'm showing now. Cannot put too long, this is very old hamster. Okay, finish. Now, I just check the mouth, whether there's an abscess or not. Okay, the chip pouch. Okay, this is an infected chip pouch. This side? No, this side is okay. This a chip pouch is here, this is a chip pouch. Okay, and this side? The right side. There is abscess here, this is the abscess. Yeah, I take out the abscess. This abscess may, may be the cause of drooling, because hamster was drooling. Now the teeth is not so long. Okay, we cannot stress him too much. So overall, overall the hamster is having the tumors, then the tumors, subcutaneous tumors. And because he's so old, so it's better not to do operation one, two, three. And there probably be some tumors inside. So I will not do any surgery and to let him recover from the anesthetic. Saturday, March 15 a very old hamster drooling, most likely due to 
abscess at the lip commissure. Okay, finished.